Hey, welcome to Gold Fever Adventures. I'm Jack Tucker. Today, what I'm going to be doing is I've got me one of these Omni Fox, you know, Gold Fox Trommels. Got me some material that I got up from a special spot that I wanted to test and see if there's any gold in it. So I'm going to go ahead and run that this morning. But what I want to show you a while back, there was a guy in camp named Wild Charles. And he wanted to go in some old mines. And so we went up and walked through some of these old mines. They were a little bit of spooky, you know, going into these mines and that. But I figured that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you our tour that we took into some of those mines. And I'm going to run some of this dirt. So anyways, I just want to thank you guys coming along and sharing on these adventures. And hey, I just hope you enjoy this one. This was a very rough hill that we had to climb up. But we made it to the top with no problem. Well, the old buggy got us up here. Well, we made it to the top of the hill. You know what we got to do now? We're going to go inside that thing. I'm following Charles in. Yes, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to follow him in. <laughs> here we go again. Going into these mines, there'll be a lot of offshoots. You never know what's around the next bend. But we're going to go in deep, and we're going to see how far we can go in until we can't go in anymore. I hope we make it back out. I didn't bring a lunch. Oh, gosh. Okay, we're going in. We're going in. One thing, when you're going inside these mines, first thing you do is look right at the entrance right there. That's where the snakes like to hang out at. That's even temperature right there. Snakes like to hang out right there. I'm sure they're all hibernating now, but you never know where they're at, so you always got to be careful. Now, I don't know if this mine is safe or not. See, it looks like it's rock. Uh, might be safe, but it's kind of hard rock. We'll see how, uh, how safe this is. I do have a secret ingredient this time. Yes. heat so I can see see it's warm back there it is warm back there but hopefully I can see a critter that's back there too might be able to see some gold veins or something too that'd be kind of cool wouldn't it but you can definitely see the heat well I guess we're getting ready to go on back I'm gonna let Charles lead the way here I'll just follow him on back through here all right We might even be able to pick up some ghosts with this machine. Man. This is uh you know, I hate walking these mines. I don't know how I get sucked into these things. Be correct. I've never been back this far. We don't know what's back here, guys. Yeah. You can see the roof of this mine. It, it looks pretty safe. You really shouldn't be walking through these mines, but uh, this looks yeah. pretty safe. Quiet. Hey, this is gonna go. This can go 
going wrong fast, man. You're going wrong fast. You think we're in a situation where this cowboy show for the guns, man? No can. They weird. dug it out, whatever it is. See right there? They uh, they dug it out right there. Did somebody recently come in here and try to find some gold? Is that what that is? Well, there's no air or water in here, so somebody dug that powder out for whatever reason. We have no clue what this brown powder stuff you know, is. Dirt right there. You could pick that dirt up. We should have brought a metal detector with us. Oh, yeah. Why didn't we bring a metal detector? I don't know, but there's, there's a chute that goes that way. One that goes that way, and this one dead end. This one. We got, we, got, we got two different ways we can go down. There's three different ways. This one, one here, dead ends there. One here. There's one over there. Um, and uh, um, guys, if you, would come, if you would do this, leave me a comment. Let me know if you would do this. And uh, if you think it's crazy to be exploring in abandoned mines, um, leave a comment. I don't know if that's a dead end. That might actually turn. Oh. That. It might actually turn. I'm thinking it might turn. So, I'm going to keep on. Keep on going. There's one of their blast poles right there. The darkness here. Where they drilled into. Put their dynamite in. Oh, uh, yeah, I think it is a dead end. Yeah, so, so when they're digging this, they're just going to follow gold, right? They'll follow that vein all the way till, vein, till it dies. Vein. So that's another so blasting hole right there. There's still some gold up somewhere in, the, in here, right? Is that gold? That's like... Sometimes the vein just didn't go off and it's still... Sometimes you walk in here and you'll see a piece that's of dynamite sticking out of there. Man. Hope we don't get lost. We haven't ran into no bats so far in here this time. It's lower. We're going to go this way now. Man, the air's starting to get a little stagnant oh, too back here. Where's my light, bro? Back of light. Are you all right? Yeah. Dead end. Old Something? timers, when they used to come in these mines, they would. They'd carry a little birdcage with them, with a little, little canary. And if the canary died, they'd get out because you can run into gases, poison gases back here. Oh yeah, that's dark. That's dead. Oh no, wait, that's not a dead end. Oh man, dude, maybe that's a dead end down there. I can't, I can't see, see enough light. Oh, yeah, I think so. No, 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 it goes for ways. Oh man, dude, look how narrow that, that might, is. That might go down this dead that's end right crazy, there. That's crazy, man. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a dead end. It kind of looks like that way. Yeah, wow, we're still going this way. Look at this, guys. It's getting, it's, <sighs> it's getting, getting deeper and deeper. Oh man, look at this mine. They, they just went, how far did they go? They went back as far as they could. How far did they go? You got that big flashlight? I'm gonna need more light, yeah. And my shadow is down here. They run into that spider from, um, that spider from, uh, that, that dead end's up there. So we don't want to go that way. Mm. Man, we're back here a ways. We are back here a ways. I think this is the way we gotta go. So we just gotta remember when we come back from this way, we gotta make it right. Well, why don't go we back do out. Why don't we just do this? We'll take the pipe. Alright guys, so we're gonna take the pipe. And we're gonna point the pipe in the direction we need to go. But also remember you take a right because somebody can come along. We're definitely deep in the bowels of the earth, that's for dang sure. That's a One of these mines that just keep on giving, man. Whew. This is crazy. This is absolutely insane. We are back here several hundred yards, I know that. And we hit the end. Okay, now we got a backtrack. Hopefully we can find our way back. Alright, man. We hit the end, so now we gotta back out of here. Alright, back out of here. Hopefully we can find our way back out. It's very sick. It is very sick. Stagnated. Like, it's like breathing in dust. It's, you get, you know, you hear the black lung and silicose and all of that. Well, guess what? If we don't make it out, then if we don't make it out, then you guys will know 
that, that we did make it up. Okay, you really gotta be careful coming in. Yeah, it is. Check it out. And there is absolutely no light up ahead. Oh, there's no light. Yeah, but this, you know, that's the thing. Like, we're supposed to be going to the in exit, right? But there's no light. So how do we know, man? If you get turned around down here, we're assuming we don't even remember how to get out of here. We're assuming we remember how to get out of here. We get turned around. Right okay. There is no. There's okay. no light up ahead. There's no light up ahead. Okay, we're gonna wait here. <sighs> Follow that arrow. Wait, wait. Oh, there's there. Somebody put an arrow. That's smart of them. Somebody put an arrow. I'm on the iron for an arrow stick and point its way out. Uh oh. Long. That's a long tunnel. Uh oh. What's the long tunnel? What does this say? This says out. Oh, look at that. That says out. That one there says long. That must be a long way. Did we go down that way? I don't think we did. Do you want to? No. <laughs> no, no. Like, you ready to get out? <sighs> Man, I think we're lost. But good thing this arrow says out. Man, you know what? It was graffiti where they basically just decided to send people in the wrong direction. I know, that's weird. That says we're long. assuming that that came from the No, front. that's a dead end. Cause, well, we didn't know. We just assumed that was a dead end. No, we went up there. We went everywhere. Okay. Out. So, this has to be the way out. Alright, we're, we're, we're going to try to see if this is the way. Oh yeah, this is, oh hell, this is where they were digging. Oh, okay, this is, okay. We see the light. We see the light at the you end guys, of the tunnel. Is, you can either, you can either, you can either you die to have this happen to you. Okay, we're almost on the way, though. That's the light. The light at the end of the tunnel. Alright, we made it back out. Alright. Oh yeah, you start to feel the fresh air now. Go towards the light. Go towards the light. Go towards the light. Well, about at the end. About at the end. We made what a view from up here. What a view. Well, that was it, folks. I tell you what, you gotta be crazy to go inside of these things. You never know if they're safe. A lot of these were built, you know, a hundred years ago or something. They, they're very unstable nowadays. So really watch yourself. You should, uh, shouldn't go in there. Definitely let people know that you're going in because you never know what you could run into. So always just be safe and better stay out. Yeah, just follow other people in there. You guys be safe and don't go in. Just follow the others. How's that? Yeah. <laughs> We love to explore. We love to just drive around, see what's what. So let's go check out this other area. Yeah, let's go do that. But there's just another mine shaft. I believe this is one that has a door on the inside of it. Got shells right there. I don't know how far this one is. I think there used to be a door right there. I think there used to be a door. Somebody took the door off. I think somebody took that door. Yeah, there used to be a door. Pretty sure there was. I don't know if that's safe to go in or not. Jill said they used to put all their you chemicals. Your right, right on that, 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 
That's next game. Go back in there. We ain't going in this one. I don't know how I keep getting involved with these, going into these mines like this, but yeah, here we are again. <laughs> There's a snake skin right there. How many where did you do? Looking for snakes. He loves snakes. He loves playing with snakes. All right, he says he wants to show me something. Oh, no, I'm serious. Look at that, man. Look at that. Check this out, man. I, 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 this is, this is huge. You better be ready, don't fall Snake territory. Got a little rattlesnake skin oh. right there. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. Right. Look there. how big that skin is. And you got all. That's this, a healthy boy. Yeah, and you got all this this this, this mouse nest right here. So what the snake is doing is sitting up here, right here. It's living here, but it's living here because there's a meal right there. They got the braces here, man. I don't know, man. We gotta be careful. Not going. Oh man, dude, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Show them that, man. Their lights on them. On the glass right here. On the any glass. Wow. There's a lot of rats here, man. The rat trap is all over. No wonder you've got the rattlesnakes in here, man. You said you heard rattlesnakes. A big old rock. I don't know if that's a cave in or they were mining around it. What do you think? Uh, kind of hard to say, huh? Are you scared yet? I've been scared, man. You've been scared? All right, be careful. There might be rattlesnakes in these rocks, man. Uh, but here, man, right here, dude. Get ready for this, man. You get the camera ready. Uh oh, it goes down, huh? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, but 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 watch this. Look, 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 look. look. There's a bat. Oh look, shit. The bats are actually going. Come on, man. Get the camera ready. <laughs> the bats are actually going right down into this pit. Wow. They're flying. Oh, there's a bat up there. See that? Oh, I do it. You see that bat? Yes, I do it. It's a bat right there. Yeah. And what they do when they wake up is they're actually literally going down. If you look down in this pit, I don't want to get too close to it because I don't want to cave in. But if you hand me your camera, hand me your camera for a minute. I'll try not to drop it. All right, we're going to look down inside this hole where these bats are flying. You can see the bats actually down there. Whoa. Oh, there you go, flying right down into the hole. Wow. Now that is cool, and it just goes down and down, and there's like a little ladder or something, something that's going down into that, into that pit. Like I don't know, it's not big enough for a person on it, unless you had a little kid. Must be like the, well, I don't know how that works, man. I have no idea how that works. So cool though. See that, Jack? Yeah. Wow. Holy Batman. Yeah, no joke, oh Batman. There's God. bats down there. Look how deep that sucker is. Wow, dude. Very cool. There you go, man. That is weird, isn't it? Yeah. And you see the bats still. Oh, man. Is that what they were falling? Yeah, that's a quick stinger. Just, just you know, a thin one, but it could have been really thick. Thank you. 
container. Ooh, baby, right up ahead. <laughs> we did come in here a ways. I wonder where all the snakes went to. I think it's just a little cold, but this is warmer here. I don't know, man. You think that they, they have been in the ground, so they could be down here anywhere. Charles had me go back in another mine. Can't believe I did that either. That, I don't like that mine. When you when you find big rat's nest and you know there's snake skin and that in there, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. No, that's not me. Charles is a little bit braver than I am. I'm not that brave. He goes back in there. He likes Maybe to play. Maybe not quite as smart as you are. He likes to play with those snakes and things. It might, it might be that I'm not quite as smart. Well, I tell you what, that was sure fun, wasn't it? Uh, <laughs> that was kind of spooky going back into those places. And, and there was a lot of times those bats came flying out at us that uh, weren't caught on camera either. And, uh, but anyways, that was kind of cool. I would never go in one of those mines by myself. And I probably wouldn't go in with one of them without anybody else. But since old Charles was there leading the way, I wasn't that scared. Anyways, hey, I want to thank you guys coming along and sharing on these adventures. So till our paths cross again, you guys all take care of yourselves and thanks for watching.